Hello everybody, welcome back to another episode of the new save file. We're jumping in again, carrying on with the deleted. I don't know which one we've got this time around, I don't remember. But we'll have a look. We could do Jerusalem again, I guess, but I kind of want to go for something a bit more weird, wacky, and wonderful. So let's see what's next. Ah, oh, bollocks. Okay. Can't pick up health for each negative effect, gain half a soul heart. Yes, okay then. Uh, let's do that one. Let's do that one. Always a bit of fun, but yeah, kind of, kind of sketchy, kind of sketchy. Let's just give it a go. This guy, I've had a win with him before, but wins with this guy are rare. We cannot pick up HP at all. And we do start with slightly worse stats than Isaac as well, which is always a bit of a bummer. Um, but we could get some good stuff. The only thing is we are required to take negative effects in order to gain HP. So we're going to have to take a lot on a lot of um, of potentially bad items. Obviously, okay, I'm just going to restart. <laughs> Not taking a hit right off the bat. That's a bad idea. Um, but yeah, obviously, uh, we don't want to take effects that are outright going to cause us to die. But we are going to have to take some effects that may not be great. Luckily, a lot of negative effects end up being not being too bad, and you can sometimes get items that have like seven or eight negative effects that all don't do much. Those are the items that we're really looking for. I mean, first of all, I've actually got to get to the item room without dying, which is a task in itself. Look at that little dodge there. The Isaac Master. The Isaac Master. That's, that's, that's what I get for like being on a 50-something streak right now. 53, 52, something like that on the... Uh, on the streak save file. I'm loving the streak at the minute, by the way. People that aren't watching the streak, what are you doing with your life? <laughs> no, but I understand why some people don't like streaking, but I find those runs really fun. I'm, I'm still taking risks. I'm still doing some stuff. And I think the min-maxing is very different to how I normally play the game. And it's leading to some interesting things and some fun gameplay elements. I'm liking it. I'm liking it. Unfortunately... No early item room is a little bit annoying. I really want to get my first uh, my first flipped item under my belt as early as possible. Really, I should be going for these. Well, just in case there's anything in them. Not that I can get HP out of them. It's just money, really. Oh, great. <laughs> yep. Might have to restart again. we got Strange Apple, which I really like. But... Nature calls. Um, yeah, that seems decent. We got a half heart out of that. Obviously not amazing. But we do use the scooper on every room, which is interesting, at least. A freebie scooper. Not a bad thing. Not a bad thing. He can Scooper can do some good damage. I don't remember what a negative effect was, but I don't think it was bad. It was something to do with eternal hearts, which shouldn't affect us too much. Shouldn't affect us too much. Oh, we do use Minecraft every now and again as well, which is... I don't know. I don't know how, how that is. Um, Very, very good item. I'm just going to take that. I know we won't gain any HP off of it, but it's a very good item. Freezing enemies on entering a room. Really good. Small bit of damage up. Really good. We got the finger. Going to the next floor. Good stuff. That's from our lemma getting wisp the... Nothing to do with our uh, glitched item. But yeah, you see what I mean? Freezing enemies, plus the finger, plus the, the peeper. Some good stuff going on here. Some good stuff going on. There's that item room already. Okay, what do you hold for us? Okay. Um, that's good. Um, yeah. Yeah, that seems decent enough. We get Flip as well, which is kind of interesting. I don't know how much use we'll get out of Flip, but it could be good. Could be good. And we've also got the Do Not Press This button, so some rooms will be automatically defeated, which is kind of nice. Um, We don't need that. We're not going to be taking Devil Deals as this character. I can assure you of that. We do not have the HP to be messing around with Devil Deals. I've not done Question of the Day yet. Question of the Day is, uh, oh yes, I forgot picking up a bomb spawns a random enemy. Got to be aware of that. For the Question of the Day today, I've not got a great one in mind, to be honest. I've not got a great one in mind. Um, What's something really stupid you did as a kid? 
something really stupid. Ah, I did. I did the OG. I was a I was a pioneer of the Fortnite fucking um, V Bucks kid. Is it V Bucks on Fortnite? I think it is, isn't it? I was a pioneer. Your active item moves to the pocket item slot if you already have a pocket item it drops on a pedestal. Oh, that would have been so good. Um, pioneer of stealing mum's credit card to buy V-Bucks. I did that before it was even a thing. I um, I used my parents' credit card to buy um, Team Fortress 2 keys so that I could open up Team Fortress 2 crits. An absolute pioneer. Okay, unfortunately our health is not very good, but yeah, obviously very, very stupid. Obviously something I should not have done. Um, but when you're a kid, you, you're dumb. You don't realize the actual value of money. And you do stupid shit like that. It wasn't a lot. I think it was under like 20 or 30 pounds or something. It really was not like a significant amount of money like at all. But still, obviously, not good. It's not like kids these days that are fucking using 500 quid. I, th I think I opened around... Around eight crates, something like that. And I think the keys are like two pound thirty nine each at the time. Um. Remove it now. Cool. I'm gonna go in here just to see if there's hearts on the floor, which doesn't matter because I can't get them. I'm stupid. I forgot about that. Right, quickly go back to my shop. See if I can reflect an item in there. Bit flipping item, I mean. To get some more HP, please. I very much like that. I'm going to place it in front of the door again. Ooh, mother's love the... And car battery. Some good stuff in here. Um, what have we got going on here? Did, did my, my finger almost destroy that? Okay. Grab that. I didn't actually get to read what that one did, because I was reading this one. Shit. I don't know what that other item did. Delete that. Cool. Yeah, I didn't, I didn't get to read what the other item did, because I was reading the wrong one. So, we have some effects that we are completely unaware of right now. But positive and negative are a mystery to us. I will say, though, out of my keys, got some pretty good stuff. Got some strange items. I got a hat. Only one hat. It was a really... It, hats in that game are like super, super expensive. But it was a pretty low tier hat. But I think it was like a hat that sold for about £50. So technically made my parents money back. <laughs> Although I didn't sell the hat. Okay, what we've got going on in here? Dog tooth. Um, it looks like the flip doesn't do anything for us, by the way. Apart from give us a damage up permanently, so I guess I'll be using flip to just gain damage ups permanently. Okay, I'll keep that in mind. Oh, god damn. We have something that gives us all the sacks, apparently. Hello, eyeball. It now. Cool. Not bad here, not bad. This run is, uh, it's going reasonably well thus far. only care about small rock in that regard there. I'm really liking the freezing enemies at the start of every room. That is very nice. Broken stopwatch, a bunch of those. Bunch of revelations. Nice trinket. Bit of extra damage, thank you. Don't need the black art. Okay. Let's keep this keep this ball a rolling. It's a weird old ball, this one. A weird old ball. Yeah, I used to play Team Fortress 2 a ton. Really enjoyed that game. That and, like, OG Overwatch. When Overwatch first came out when, like, they hadn't added a bunch of crap to it. 
Good stuff. Um, no, <laughs> I do. I would rather not spawn sixteen poop with flies in every room. Thank you. Not every other room, should I say? I've got tears the arc now. I like my revelations on occasion, that's kind of nice. It's just an overall very good run thus far. Haven't got anything too negative going on. If I could get something that smelts trinkets, would be happy as well. We're getting trinkets every six rooms, I think it is. Good, good. Yeah, kids do the dumbest shit. It is bad, like, I mean, it's not like my parents didn't teach me well, but kids just have absolutely no value for money whatsoever. And I mean, why would they? I mean, until, until you're like, until you're like, realistically, like, 13 or 14, maybe, I don't know, maybe 12, 12, 13, 14, you really don't have a very good grasp on how the world works and what role money plays, because you just have, you don't really get money given to you that much. Uh, I mean, some kids get an allowance. I, I that that seems to be like an American thing, though. I don't know a single kid in the UK to ever have had an allowance. If you had an allowance in the UK, your parents were rich, <laughs> and you didn't need one anyways. <laughs> that was that was basically the long and short of it. <laughs> um, but I I didn't know anyone at my like my school because in my like in my the school that I went to and the friends I had, no one was rich. <laughs> Well, that was generally, generally when when kids would have an allowance um, in the UK. Not obviously, it's not all the time, but yeah. So kids didn't really have their own money until you're like sort of 12, 13. Um, and so before then, you just have no real concept or value of money. So you do stupid shit with money. Like kids will like fucking rip it up and shit, won't they? It's the dumb. They're stinky doo doos. What is it that's giving me sacks? How many keys are you going to take from me, boy? A lot. We're in it now. Oh god, I picked up a Rob Ross worm. No! It smelted automatically because of that other item we've got. Fuck me. Oh no no. Okay, so a Rob Ross worm is gonna be doing its thing here. Still don't really know what's giving us all these sacks, but we've we've entered some kind of infinite loop here. Unfortunately we can't gain health off of the back of this, so. This is kind of, I'm, I'm, I'm very, having a really hard time getting out of here, because every time I touch a bomb, it spawns more enemies. Let's get out of that room. Got a lot of happy little trees here. Didn't actually mean to flip the item there, that's my bad. Get two broken hearts, why not? Okay, let's get out of here. Let's skedaddle. Weird run. Health is meh. Health is meh. Come on, copper bombs. Don't let me down. Ball and chain, baby. On active, use Damocles. Okay. Why not? Why not get some Damocles going? More items means more chaos. More items means more health, though. So, if you think about it... Ooh. Heal a broken heart to start the floor. I think I'll take that. I have broken hearts, and I could potentially get more. Really? It's you? Oh, it's... It, by the way, it does seem like these trees are all spawning tears. It's just a shame that the tears don't like to go towards the enemy they say they're gonna go towards. 
Like, look at this, they're just, like, chilling. There's so many of them and they're not fucking doing anything. Anyways, have an easy time of killing bosses. Right, away we go. Apparently I ch got a different trinket there, don't know when that happened, but alright. The Ouroboros Worm, why did I have to pick that up, fuck's sake. I've got an XL floor here. Do like the invincibility on occasion, don't really know what triggers it, but when it happens I'll take it. Walk into the goddamn fires for once, please. Broken remote? No, 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 no. No broken remote for me, thank you. I'd rather not be teleporting here, there, and everywhere. Go towards that item room, shall we? Right, there's, there's a Damocles in play. Damocles is in the house. And we got random item we don't know. Random item we don't know. Could be bad. Could be beautiful. Again, we don't know. Oh, uh, is it a half? Is it a half red heart that causes it? Oh lord! No! Picking up keys spawns troll bombs. I didn't mean to do this. I've caused serious problems. I've had a grave error. Also, I got some wish shots from somewhere. Don't know where. It's not good though. Wish shot is not what we want. Oh, and I've just... Did Damocles actually fall? Did Damocles actually fall? Are you... Are you... Rubbing my balls? What on earth? It had been like two fucking seconds, game. That would be ridiculous if Damocles actually fell, then. I don't know what's going on. Oh, we got the rat thing. Is that the rat item? Dude. Dude. My whiz shots are stacking, and I'm getting a lot of them. I quite like that. The tower just went off, and I don't know why. No more Damocles for us. Anyways, this has been uh, hilarious so far. Gotta love it. We are away once again. Don't touch or pick up anything. Bombs are terrible. Keys are terrible. No, 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 no. There's so many golden troll bombs. Where did all these come from? Fuck me. What have I done? What have I done? I've created a world where everything is out to hurt me. It's funny, but it's bad. At least I'm very strong. <laughs> At least I'm very strong. Damocles 2. Electric Boogaloo. This is such a bad idea, taking all of these items randomly. Hello. More items. Okay. Do you all want to die? Quick and simple. There's a lot of items here. What in the fuck? That's a lot of golden troll bombs. <laughs> I'm hoping that was an initial pickup effect rather than every item we pick up is now going to do that. Otherwise we are in for some risky business. Okay. Just keep trying to plod along and ignore the various 
mechanics of death coming our way. We've got a lot of dips. Oh my lord, that's a lot of pennies. We gulp every single whip worm. Thank god they don't stack. Thank god two is the maximum. Because we gulp every single goddamn one of them. Yes, that's this rat thing. Any room made by the same creator will be immediately deleted. Crawl space, nice. Does make it very hard to hit things with this much shot speed, I will say. Having a very hard time. <laughs> I really wish this little air freshener item actually did something. It's so terrible. Just plops tears everywhere for no good reason. Don't know what just happened. Oh, <laughs> It got rid of everything in there. Okay, apparently I lost all of my, um... What's it called? Dunce caps. I don't know how. Do I lose them on damage? I must lose them on damage or something. Okay, this is good. My dips are doing a good job too. That's nice. Hey, baby plum. I forgot that I had a 9% chance to spawn you on killing a boss. Get rocketed. Why can't we see our items again? I don't know what's going on with my vision. Down we go. <laughs> Found a lot of donation machines there. I don't know what's, how, what's happened to my vision, but it's bad. <laughs> I can't really see anything. I don't seem to be able to fire either. Having a really hard time knowing where to go because I can't fucking see the map or anything. How am I meant to get through this room exactly? Um, yeah, so we've got this infinite loop going. If we think of a bomb, it makes a troll bomb. The room's apparently over there. Are they red poops? I, I genuinely can't tell. I think they are, but I don't think we're taking damage to them. Oh, I can see again. Oh, no, no, I can't. Let me out. Wait, I don't think we can get out that way. I think I'm walking into nothing. What's with all the peeper's eyes? I don't know where I am. Why is my vision so clouded? What is this bullshit? What's going on? How has the game not crashed yet? There's a boss in here now. I don't know what's going on. I don't know how I'm not taking more damage. How do I make it through so many rooms and I can't get out of this one? It just keeps spawning more and more bosses. There's too many coins in here now. I think I'm dead. I've got I've got to die, and then Guppy's call has got to revive me outside of this room. This is my only way out. I'm just gonna leave leave the game to do its thing. Leave the game to do its thing. And eventually I'll die. 
After I, after my thousandth one makes you smaller pill. I mean, the good thing is I have 148 range. 150. I have 55 shot speed. Don't know how I've broken the cap on that, but I have. How am I not taking damage? I don't get how I'm not, like, taking any damage. Am I just, like, hanging out until Damocles falls? What's... What's the deal here? <laughs> I'm so confused. Oh, enjoy the slideshow, everybody. Let's talk about something else while we wait, shall we? Um... Let's talk about something else. Well, to be fair, I'm gonna get back to Team Fortress 2. Yeah, Team Fortress 2 and, like, like, before the days of all the stupid characters that got added to Overwatch, that game was great. It was just, like, better Team Fortress 2, although it wasn't better, because Team Fortress 2 will never be beaten. Hey, we finally took some damage! I miss the days of playing Team Fortress 2. I miss the days. Our range has gone down. Our shot speed has gone up, though. Yeah, that used to be a game that I would play literally non-stop. Reflected. Just touch the reflected item. It says the reflected bomb there. Touch it so we can take some damage. I'm just curious as to what I have to be not taking damage constantly here. There's clearly explosions. This room is full of troll bombs, like golden troll bombs and otherwise. Also, I've, I've had about a billion one makes you small as now, so I imagine I'm invisible almost. Which might be one of the reasons I'm not taking damage, because of the smaller hitbox. There's two more hits, game. That's all we gotta do. It's literally walking into enemies right now, I think. There's a lot of people's eyes, I can't really tell. Oh, we've got up to 238 range. <laughs> this is just the silliest. You watch, I'll do all this and Guppy's, Guppy's collar won't even revive me. Oh, we finally took some more damage. One more hit. One more hit. It's gonna crash, isn't it, before before we get that one last hit. I, I actually can't believe it's still going. It's impressive. This game's got some real kahunas. It knows how to stand up to uh, the, the devilish deeds I put it up against. I see a death's head in there. There's a there's a just a random sterny chilling in here. I wonder how many bombs are in this room right now. Probably like a thousand. <laughs> the problem is, this could easily happen again. I can't remember how this started, but this could happen again. We should have to avoid picking up anything ever. I'm just taking a sip of my Fanta while we wait. Nice bit of Fanta. 176 range now. I've been slowly getting some luck as well. My god. We just keep getting one makes you smaller. I I'm looking at where the peepers are to, to find out where we are. Peepers are in the top left, so we're kind of just being forced into the top left. Oop. We picked up some money. How are we not on, like, 999 money and keys either? Like, what's going on with them? Like, there seems, there seems to be loads of money on the floor and I'm not able to get any of it. Oh, there's one of those red blocks. One of those red blocks. You can hit me, surely. Surely you can hit me. Apparently we keep killing bosses as well. There's, like... An infinite cycle of monsters spawning and dying in this room. Oh, the game's re it's been struggling, but it's really struggling now. The frame rate has has taken a a pretty significant tumble. Oh, oh, we died, we died. 
You can do it, game. Just play out the death animation and let us escape this fiery hellfire. Come on, we're dead. We're already dead. It's just waiting for the death animation to play out. Oh my god, what the fuck? Oh! No! It put us in the wrong room. It didn't even work, are you kidding me? Oh. Let's do a- let's do a rewind and see what happens. Let's see if rewind helps us. It probably won't. This might make everything much, much worse. I still just die. I can't rewind. If I rewind, I just- I'm stuck in a loop of dying. Because of the red poops, I think. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Well, that was fun. I hope you guys enjoyed whatever that was. And yeah, we'll see you guys in the next one.